Hello YouTube, this is Dragonheart and welcome to Total War Network's Let's Play series for Total War Rome 2 Hannibal at the Gates. We are playing as Rome, we are playing on normal difficulty. I won't go through all the texture, I'll give you guys a chance to read all that and I shall start the campaign. So I'll give you a quick um, synopsis on what the campaign is. Basically loads of different YouTubers will be doing an hour of this campaign on their channel. So for example I will be YouTuber number one then the next person will be YouTuber number two, and so on and so on. Everybody gets to play the same save file, and it should be a pretty good campaign, and I hope it takes off, and I hope that you guys will enjoy the content that we all provide for you. And um, I'll give you a quick uh, update on who I am. I'm Dragonheart, as I mentioned earlier. I'm from Wales in the UK. I've been doing YouTube for a little over a year now and I enjoy, I enjoy this game so much, I enjoy Total War games, I played the first Rome game that was the first Total War game that I played I played Medieval 2, Empire, I didn't enjoy Empire as much as, as Medieval 2 and the first Rome Shogun 2 was brilliant, I enjoy that game and there we go, so this is the trailer for the first part in this campaign Hannibal my son Hannibal my son Stand before the gods and swear Swear. <laughs> this day until your last. It's a lovely elephant, nice golden one. You'll always be an enemy of Rome. Ooh, bitchy. Just sit and enjoy the opening to this campaign. You insult Rome! You have violated the treaty that binds you. I will remind you, the last time Carthage resisted Rome, your fathers were buried in the fields of city. <laughs> Those that didn't greet the dove with open arms, we sent to serve Neptune in the waters of the Agatis. <laughs> Mediterranean is undoubtedly ours, not yours. And you've gifted us whatever scraps of it you held when you and your mercenaries scurried back to your barbaric fishing village. And I am sent here to ask you to decide between peace and open conflict as if you truly have a choice. I choose war. So there we go. Okay, we're going to skip this bullshit. There we are. So the campaign has officially begun. And, oh my god, missions everywhere. Okay, let's ignore that bullshit for now. Oh my god, so much bullshit. Right, ignore, oh, and again. <laughs> that surprised me then, all this, all these messages. What am I doing over here? Let's get back to Rome. Okay, so the campaign has begun. Let's have a quick overview of what we own. So we have war with, oh my god we have war with lots of people here the Volkai over here, Liguria, Carthage obviously, Carpitani and that's it. So we'll ignore the Carpitani because they, they're nowhere near us at the moment same with the Volkai, we want to focus on Liguria in the north and Carthage in the south. Who likes us? Massilia, Emporion, the Etruscans like us, I find that surprising okay um, do I conquer them? I could conquer them and take all of this. That would be, that would be fun. Syracuse could trade with them. That might actually be a good idea. Maybe we can get some trade with Syracuse. Maybe some money as well. Let's see. How about 500? Nope. How about just to trade? Oh. They want 400 and they're willing to go to war with Carthage. Why not? Thank you very much. How about that trade now? How about that trade? Fuck you. Okay. <laughs> so this is going to be a cool campaign. And everything that I do in this first part will affect the next person that takes over this campaign. And I also think with the naming of your army, it'd be a pretty cool idea if every YouTuber in this Let's Play gets to name their own individual army. So let's have a look around. I want to name the army by Rome. The Spears of Menrava. Or I think it's supposed to be Minerva. 
if it's not spelled like that. Anyway, let's go on to details. And I'm going to call my army in this campaign TWN Dragonheart. Makes sense. My little lone army. And I think that'll be pretty cool. So we're at war with Carthage in the south. We want to get a few battles in this part. Carthage is today. I could go for Carthage straight away. That'd be pretty cool. So, first things first, Lilibium, expand the city, and I want to get some workshops, I want to get some artillery, I love my artillery, Shrine of Minerva, Public Order, Public Order is okay at the moment actually, nearest army, I want to get an army near there don't I, so let's, let's get my navy, let's get the navy all the way around to begin with, and let's see, got an army here, the Harbingers of Februs, Get him all the way down to Lilibium as well. Asana is minus four, that's okay for now. Let's see, three, three or whatever the hell you pronounce that. Let's expand that as well. We can have a filler, get three food, that'll be handy. And we're out of money more or less. Let's look at our technology. So the technology in this is a little di bit different to the Grand Campaign. Some of it's been researched for you already. And it actually counts as diplomacy, I think. Yeah, diplomacy. So. Plus 10 to diplomacy with Italian, Iberian and African factions. Why not? Let's just go for that. Tarentum. It's fine. Let's see. Capua. Capua. Reminds me of uh, Spartacus. I love that series. Spartacus was a pretty good series. I do miss watching that. Might watch it later actually. Oh, so many lands I can, I can actually expand. And what armies do I have in the north? I have this one over here, the Thunderbolts of Tina, or Tinia, Tinia it is. Aretum, is this all that the Etruscans own? If it is, I might, ah, oh, Tar, oh, these three by here, Tarquinquinae, Spoletium, and Aretium. What we got? Two, eight, ten, ah, oh, we can, we can wipe them out, I think. Let's, let's get a war with the Etruscans. Oh wait, they're a client state of mine. I don't want. I don't want to go to war with them. Then let's get trade instead. Let's get trade. For now, please. Yay, we've got some trade. Excellent. Okay, so I'm happy to leave them as they are. The next YouTuber that comes along will probably annihilate them, so I'll leave them to YouTuber number two, <laughs> whoever you may be. I can upgrade this army. I need the armies in the south, so I'm going to bring this one all the way down. I could force march them. I might do that actually. Force march them. Where are you gone? Oh shit. I've lost them. Oh, they're walking. It's okay. Force march you all the way down south. We want to get you. Let's get to Masana at the moment. Then we'll deal with you then. We have the Samnites. Do they like us or do they hate us? Samnites are neutral. We could trade with them. We could take them out, actually. I might take them out. Let's see. They own. Oh, they own four different settlements or provinces. Or settlements, I mean. Settlements. They could end up being a thorn in my backside, so I may want to, to take them out at some stage. Uh, just trying to think if there's anything else I can do this turn. I don't think there is. Move this army, haven't we? Yes, we have. One more look at diplomacy, and I think I'll end the turn. Sesatani are all the way over here. Could they trade with us, I wonder? Let's see. Trade agreement, moderate, okay. What about some money? 500? Moderate. Fuck you. Okay, they don't want to trade with us. Just trade. Okay, that'll do. That's fine. Libya, you are client state of Carthage, so I doubt I'll get very far with you. What if I offer you money instead? I can only offer you 200 though. Nope. Okay, fair enough. And I think. Oh, Masa Ili. Now they're in Africa. They could be a, a key. Well, they are actually military allies of ours, but they could be a useful ally against Carthage. Trade. Access? No. Okay, they're not going to do anything with me at the moment. Fair enough. Samnites, Syracuse. I thought I had trade with Syracuse. Did I get trade with them? No. Oh, no, I have. That's good. There we are. So I think that can end the first turn. So without further ado. Oh, shite. What's this? I want to. Blah, 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 blah. Edict. Oh, shit. Right. Edict. Um, what's my. No, not here. Blah, 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 blah. Not here. Nope. Nope. Oh, Capua, Rome. It's this one. Yes, yeah, this one. So what we want, we want food, could be useful, but we got 34 food. Public order might be handy. I'll go for tax for now. 
squeeze so much. Oh my god, another one. Oh, over here. Oh, I forgot to look over here. Shit. Fail. First fail of the campaign. We'll get, in that case, we shall get... Population's happy with me. Latin? Do we need Latin? Let's have a look what we got. Public order is stable. Latin is 56%. Could do with a little bit more, so maybe that will be... That will be good for now. And now we can enter in. Yay, enter in. So I hope you're all having a good day. I hope you all enjoy this series, and I can't wait to watch the next person play this, because it's kind of cool to have that input. Oh my god, what is this? Right. <laughs> Ally has been attacked. Aggressor is the Etruscan's defender is the Insubures. I want to enter war on side of the Ally. That's the Etruscan's. Isn't it? Oh, shit. No, it's not. Uh-oh. Am I... Uh-oh. Okay, guys. Some bullshit just happened there. Did I go to war with the Etruscans then? Yeah, I did. Shit. I thought they were my allies. Uh-oh. Okay, first fail of the campaign. It's okay, we can fight back. Let's get these guys out of force march. Stance none. Let's see, how far can we go? We're gonna march this army into the Etruscan land over here. My own army now is, is gonna have to come into battle, I think. We could march to Tarquinai. I think we could take on... Is that a wall city? It looks like it's a wall city. Shit, that's going to be difficult to take out. Do we have any ballista? No, we don't. Could get some Italian cavalry and Italian spearmen. Uh, nothing in the north? No. I keep thinking I've got a settlement up here, but I don't. It's, it's all part of... Yes, it's pis, pis, uh, Pissorum. Piss. Total piss, right. I got no armies over here or here. Yeah, I need to I need to take out the Etruscans. That's the hang on, how many settlements? Four settlements. Maybe this isn't oh it's a minor settlement. Ah, that's the big one, right. We wanna take the big one out. Oh wait, that's the Sam Knights. Fucking hell, what am I doing wrong? Look at the wrong settlement. Shit 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 shit. Up here. This is where we are. Confuse myself. Now right, minor, minor this is the uh, provincial capital. This is what we need to take out. And um, we have fairly good garrisons, I think. But we're going to have to work on taking these guys out. Otherwise, they're going to be, like I said earlier, a pain in the arse. I could send both of these in to attack Tarquinai. This one is currently used up all its movement points. I'm going to actually upgrade all of these while we're here. This army... I don't want to use this one. I don't want to lose my own army. Total War Network Dragonite. In that case, we're going to attack with this one at Sp Spoletium. We'll have our first battle of the campaign. Oh, and we shall win this easily. And we shall fight the battle. So, assault time. Battle of Spoletium, 218 BC. Total War Network Dragonite versus a garrison army. Looks like they have mob, some spearmen. Italian spearmen and some slingers. We have cavalry. I'm going to try and use the cavalry on on these shit units over here. I should be able to rack them up then with the rest of my infantry. And hopefully we get our first win. Now I should warn you guys that are new to this, this channel of mine. Um, I'm not the best of a Total War games. I'm not... Don't expect a miracle from me. Don't expect to see skills as equal as uh, other people that you, you've probably seen. But I do try my best. But I do make plenty of mistakes, so just a quick heads up for you guys. Where is the enemy? Oh, they're over there. Shit. See what I mean? I pray for the victory today. I can't be asked to his speech because it's kind of shit. And I could probably do a better speech myself. Brave Romans, this is your commander Dragonheart speaking. Kill the enemy. There will be wine waiting for you at the end of the battle. Good day. Okay, so I want to get all these. I want a quick reload. Got loads of special abilities. Look at all this bullshit. Special abilities galore. Excellent. Right. Send the general up here. It looks like they're going to camp behind the hill. Let's have a little look at the, Rome, uh, the Etruscans. I'm my little Etruscan, short down. Oh my god, look at the spots on you. I think he's got um, chlamydia or something. Doesn't look good, does it? And there's their general. Excellent, right. So we're going to try and flank around with the cavalry. Unfortunately, I'd like to go up on the hill over there, but the battlefield doesn't let me go that far. So I can only go as far as there. I'm going to get the uh, slingers. 
all the way out there. All my infantry is going to go right behind them. And for the sake of it, let's go on to the tactical map to feel important. So, this is the battlefield. General, Soshai Equete, Levies, Velites, Velites, and all my infantry. Little mount with all the bullshit by there. Should be good. There they go, they're moving out now. Might get a chance to flank behind them and hit them in the arsehole. If so, that would be very, very nice for me. Not nice for them. Proud Romans! Nice little uh, town over there. I like. I do like looking at the scenery. Like, uh, if you look at the top of there, you can see just see the mountain over there, the clouds. I wish the battles were bigger. I like. I wish like you could like fight all the way up there, and you know perhaps over there. It would be nice if you could do that. Unfortunately, I think the game would probably crash if it was made to be that big. But we'll see. So, we're going to attack the mob first, I think. I'm going to group up my infantry, mainly because we will be going into full-on attack mode shortly. Just going to group up, look we'll at all the special abilities on right-click, ready for when they want to attack them. Attack them. Quick reload. Attack them. Charge time. Here we go. Fun time, guys. Fun time. Let's get a little, little unit cam. Charge! For the glory of Rome. Whee! Where's my general? Is that him? I think that might be him. I think it is. Charge! Right, there we go. We're, we're engaging them. You can charge that bullshit. You can charge that bullshit. You two can charge them. You can flank to that one. Oh, where's the general going? That's okay. General can attack the levies, but they, we can attack them, but they, they're all routed in. All of these slingers can now sling them, but they, they're going to hit them there. Horseman's going to attack around onto the slingers there. So what special abilities have we got today? Loose space there, I think we need that. Doing okay, I think. Yeah, doing pretty good. Battle will be won shortly, I, I imagine. Uh, there we go, they all route in. Kill them all! Kill them all! Ah! There we go, they're all dead. Victory! End battle. Decisive victory. So, victory in our first battle in this campaign. And it was a glory. I didn't lose anybody. Oh my god, that was pretty cool. Didn't lose anybody in this game. Who had the most kills? My cavalry had 238. I love cavalry. One of my favourite units in, in Total War games are cavalry. I seem to be the type of, most people seem to lose their cavalry but keep all the infantry and their slingers. I'm the type of person that will lose his his cavalry. But no no will keep his cavalry, sorry. But lose everything else. So my my army's doing pretty well. We've taken Spletium. We can actually upgrade this, but we actually have a full province with that now by the looks of things. Do we? No we don't. Yes we do, no we don't. Yes we do. This army Oh, I don't want to lose my own army here. That's not good. We can level up, which is good. Let's see. Do, 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 do. Cunning. We'll go for authority for now. I'm going to take Aretium next, I think. Pisai over here. Pisai is part of Aretium and Tarquinii. Uh, what's the eight units? Rorari plebs and units. Uh, they've only got four men. Should be able to deal with them. Tar that's going to be the difficult one to take. Right. Okay, that's that. Let's just double check what we've got in the south. I think it's all going pretty well in the south. This army is currently marching towards um, Lillibium. I'm going to camp, put them there for now. Build this one up. I think whoever takes um, over after me in this Let's Play should name this one after them. And they can they can start the war with Carthage. But I think my, my role in, at, the, at the start of this Let's Play is going to be the war with the Etruscans. So I'm going to try and deal with the Etruscans. At least if I get them out of the way for the next person, then that will be pretty cool. And Syracuse is on a good side as well. I haven't actually played Hannibal at the Gates with Rome. I'm currently doing a campaign on my channel with the Arivaki. And I'm hopefully going to be doing a, a co-op campaign with the Dude as well. Playing as the Lusitani, so that should be pretty cool for me. But enough about that. Let's concentrate on this campaign right now. And I've used up all, that, all my movement points. I've used up all my money as well. Quick little check of the diplomacy. So, 
yeah, I'm allied with these. They're a client state. That, see, this is where diplomacy gets me a bit confused because I'm allied with them. I was also with the Etruscans. I thought I was going to be with the Etruscans and go to war with them, but oh well. I was going to take it anyway. Well, I was thinking about taking it. I can't upgrade these yet, unfortunately, but I will be doing that when I get a bit more money. This army is going to have to reinforce soon because I don't like being left open. Anyway, end turn. I'm talking too much. End turn. <laughs> There we go. So, oh my fucking god, right. The Allo Bruges, Bruges, oh no. I got lots of allies though, so hopefully some of them will come over. Yes, only two of them haven't. Boyai and Insu Burez, because they are a bunch of twats. They're too pussy. Oh, what's this? The Etruscans! They want peace and they want to offer me money. This isn't a bad idea, because I want to be happy with them, but, and I could do with the money, of course. But I think I can take them out, so I reject your kind offer, sir. Uh oh. Holy fuck. Right, we have been attacked by Liguria at um, Pisai. And the Etruscans, the backstabbers, are gonna assist them as well. We only have a garrison force, so we're going to. We're gonna sally forth, I think. Oh my, this isn't looking good, is it, guys? The champions of Latinus. And the fury of Sabazios. What do I have? I have a couple of plebs. <laughs> a couple of levies for the looks of things. And some basic spearmen. It's not going to be... Not going to be pretty for me. I'm going to have to use all my cunning in this battle, I think. Oh my, what's going on here? Oh, right, but the, at the edge of the battlefield. And let's go for this bullshit camera. Let's have a look. We've got some... Look, we've got a mountain over here. Maybe over here as well. Ugh, I don't know. Nice mountain by here. Looking for what's going to be the best place to deploy. I like this by here. I, I can probably see them from here, so let's get all this bullshit up here. Start the battle, guys. It's going to not be pretty. As expected, they're going to be going through there. We're going to go through there instead. I don't want to be caught between them down here and then here should that work? Uh oh I don't think it will so cancel order just go there <laughs> and I don't know where the reinforcements are going to be either where's the edge of the battlefield nope no reinforcements I don't want to fight in the trees because I don't like that bullshit uh oh don't like this Sextus Cursor, Rorari Rorari! Run, you fucking idiots! Yep. They're gonna all die, I think. I'm sorry, guys, but you're not gonna live this one, I don't think. Not unless I come up with a miracle. Let's try and get organized anyway. So let's get the levies. About there. Um, we're gonna sandwich the plebs in behind them, I think. Oh shit, don't do that, right. Levies. Then the plebs and them. We'll actually get the Rorari in another line behind, like so. They'll probably come out of the bushes in a second, I think. Can't see where uh, Liguria are. They've all got, this is what I don't want, they're all in there. May have to go fishing for them. Yeah, I might have to go in and, and try to coax them out. Try and look at the battlefield, what can I use at my advantage? Open plane here. I don't really like fighting in the corner though, it's kind of it's kind of cheating in a way. Uh, let's send the plebs in. They're useless, so let's send one of them in. Just so I can locate where they are. That's right, my friend. Oh, there they are. There they are. Let's come back. Let's come back. <laughs> I think we found them. Shit. Plebs. Kill them. Kill them, my plebs. Kill the light horse. Don't run. Fuck. If I get my missiles to con conquer, to fight them. Oh my god, we lost most of our men already. Shit. I didn't think, I didn't expect much though in this battle. 
Romance, kill them all. Fucking plebs running away. Ah, that's it. <laughs> Did we get any kills? We killed five! <laughs> and that one of them was my Rorari. Oh, God. Went from one extreme to the next. From a, from a victory where I didn't lose anybody to a, a defeat where I killed five. What a way to start. Didn't expect much from that battle, though. Ooh, right in the gut, that's gonna hurt. Oh my. So they've taken Pisai. Pisai, Pisai. They lost nine. Must have been friendly fire. Oh, they've they've just raised it, I think. Oh, they sacked it. That's what I meant. Mission successful. Be at war. Didn't even know that was a mission. Ah, oh, what's this bullshit? Right, we want to get military. Can we have loads of wars to prepare for? Now, what do we want to do next? They've raised that. I think that's a lost cause. The Etruscans are suffering attrition, though, so that is good news. This army, we could go for Tarquinai. How much? How much? Money have we got? Let's have a look at things a minute. Let's see. Right, first things first. We're gonna get a Temple of Neptune. Oh, it costs a lot of money though. Shit. Spletium. Consecrated ground. I want to get the public order back up in this region first. Cover my backside. How many mercenaries have we got available? Hoplites. How much do they cost? Four hundred fifty. I think I could take Tarquinai with this army, f with the mercenaries, so, two, three, how much money is this going to cost me? Nearly, nearly 2,000. Let's go for it guys, let's go and kill the Etruscans. Thunderbolts of Tinia, Tinia, Tina, however you want to pronounce it. Could auto resolve, but that's, that's kind of uh, bullshit, so we will assault them, and hopefully we can take them out. We have lots of cavalry, which I'm a bit concerned about. I gotta burn their gates down as well, which I don't like doing. It's one of the things I hate with sieges. Fortunately, they've only got two missile troops, and they have suffered some uh, attrition because of the attrition the Etruscans are facing. They must be out of food or something, so... Yeah, hopefully we can take them out, and then the Etruscans will be down to one province. So, start deployment. And of course, oh, of course we've got ladders, haven't we? Right, so let's see what the best place to attack this place is. Let's see. Gate there. Towers over there. At the back. Could be, but right, could just go straight through the gate, I think. Uh, let's see. Another gate by here. Tower is fair distance away. Those houses probably blocking the ladders. I think we probably go from, from here, because I can get the ladders to go from this angle. So I'm going to get the cavalry. I'm gonna put them just just behind for now, but there. Get the slings, levies, missile troops ready. Get the mercenary. Got the ladders on there, okay? So we want to get you there. You there. Let's get this bullshit out the way. There we go. General. Start the battle. You can go there. You can go there. You can go there. And you can drop. That was a nice speech, guys. Nice speech. <laughs> so, they have their slingers as expected on the walls. I want to weaken them with my own slingers. If I can kill a few of them, that would be great. So let's send my slings forward. No point setting the cavalry, and I could burn the gate, I suppose, with the cavalry. But I don't want to risk losing most of my cavalry. Of course, I got my mercenary Etruscan hoplites as well, which should be should be fun. Hoplites. I could send in my Italian spearmen to go for the to go for the gate simultaneously, so all the men that had the, the ladders at the beginning of the battle are all involved. The gatehouse is starting to fire, which I don't want. We will take some losses, I know. I'm starting to take them now already. But if I can outflank them on the walls with these units, come across, kill them, take the gatehouse, may not have to burn it down. But I'm just going to start burning it down so they've got lots of people to worry about. So this one's going to go for that wall. 
there. This one's going to go for the wall up there, like so. This one's on its way there. How many have we killed? 84. 84 of them dead. Kill them all! Oh shit, look at the fire coming down from that tower. I always find it funny that with the towers in Rome 2, you can't actually see anybody in them. It's quite funny. Missiles awaiting targets. So, we're at the walls. Made it to the wall. They probably got their unit some way by here. Probably in the in the capture point, actually. Wouldn't be surprised. We are taking some losses. We are doing some fire damage, though. And our men are going to wipe out their slingers shortly. So I think I could probably advance now with these. Get ready to get in there. We'll stick them into Phalanx straight away. I'll hold back with the cavalry and the rest of my stuff for the time being until I'm actually into the city and I have control of the gatehouse. Now I'm hoping that they don't glitch on the walls because I've had I've had some bad experiences with my let's plays where my men have gone halfway up the ladder and then not gone gone up the wall and the tower has just continued to fire and and kill them. So yeah, I hope that doesn't happen here. There we go. The Levy Slinger is dying after meeting just a few of my my men. Kill them all. There we go. Let's take that tower now. All the slingers are gone by the looks of things. And we are starting to take the the tower. So let's just get my men formed up there. Let's get my men formed up there. Velite. This one's out of ammu ammunition, so you just come back for now. This one can halt. They've only got a little bit left, though, so it might be a bit pointless. Right, so all their stuff is over here. They have spearmen. Well, I think what I'll try is form a phalanx across the street with my pikemen, my Etruscan hoplite, sorry. Goad them with my cavalry down the street and try to get them to run into my my phalanx. I think that's where I'll try. My spearmen can actually not attack that that now. There we go, lovely jubbly. So get the spearmen, all my spearmen down here. We'll, we'll cordon off the the streets. We'll try to get them. What they have all together? Have mob, spearmen, 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 mob, and spearmen. So it's mainly spearmen we have to worry about. But I think we got much better spearmen than them. So. Let's just get our asses down there quickly, and this one as well. Hoplites are ready. There we go, all the speedmen's going there. Keep the velites back because they're useless. And now I think I could probably take the cavalry in. We're just going to put them... If we can, let's see, where, where are they going? Alright. Ah, I don't want to go that far in though because they could... Keep my side for now, because that tower might cause some some grief for us. Let's get a first unit of Hastati forward to engage their uh, spearmen, I think. Yeah, we'll send the one unit forward. Hop the tay. Hop lights, hop the tay. Let's get that like that. Let's just get them in. Italian spearmen. There we go. I think we have to go to them. Charge, we go for a attack and test judo just before we get to the flank with this one. Let's go up there. Get that bullshit in there. Top lit day. Oh shit now. Take on the spearman with my start my my Italian spearman. 128 versus 128. It's gonna be an even battle, I think. Oh my god, what's going on? Oh, controlling two of them, that's why. Oh, what is going on, guys? Only got one view. There we go, lovely. Ah, what is. Pathfinding is terrible. Up like that, that will do, that will do nicely. Uh oh, we're flanked up here. Our tower is now firing over there. Let's get them up there, and them up there. It's got a blob in with everything now. Go for a nice bit of blob in. Italian spearman. Let's get all my stuff in there. Get Phalanx going. You can jump in as well. And now I think we can get the cavalry in. Let's send two of them in first. Because the pathfinding is getting a bit confusing in this city for me. 
Spearmen, the generals, but they want to take him out quickly as well. We're only against mob units here mainly, and, and the Italian spearmen. Kill them all! Charge! Kill them all! There we go. They're going to jump in there for me. Hoplites, phalanx. Using the whip. Um, where can we flank to? Right, I know. Let's get the cavalry. How are we going to do this? Like that, all the way around. And then we can hit them in the rear with the two units of cavalry there. We bring in the next two as backup, just in case. Uh, can't go up there, unfortunately. Nope. It's a shame I was going to outflank up there and hit them as well. Right, mob is, ru is running away. Italian spearmen doing pretty well for me indeed. Cavalry's going to outflank them. Oh, what are you doing? This unit stopped for some reason. There we go. Cavalry's going to go for a charge around the side. Same with these. Through there. And there. Charge! Kill them all! Kill them all! Oh my god! Towers! <laughs> Better watch those towers! Better watch those towers indeed. Right, so. Death to all that oppose us. We're going to be taking the capture point as well with this. But I think we can actually get off our horses though to take this capture point. So we are going to have to be careful. I'm going to send this unit of cavalry into the rear of these units. I'm going to go for a nice little charge from up here. Here we go. The general's now routed as well. Hammer and anvil time. Uh oh. For this unit. And back in. This unit is going to go for another charge through there. And they're all starting to route now. Send some more cavalry in for the sake of it. Watch the charge. Charge downhill. Oh, blood and guts everywhere. Death to all who oppose us. He's dead, he's dead. They're all dead, I think. They're, they're all routed in. And we have victory. End the battle there. Only lost 150. They only killed 38. These battles have been very lopsided so far, haven't they? Who had the most kills? Let's see, 99. My horsemen, my cavalry had 99. Nice charge in the rear, always does good. Oh! Into the shoulder blade, and he is dead. Tarquinai is ours. Occupy. Increase in rank. And at minus 89, that's not good. We may have a rebellion shortly. They've taken Pisai though, so we need to take Aretium and the Etruscans will be gone as well. Ah, oh, bugger, I can't do anything this turn. Is there going to be a rebellion next turn? Public order is deteriorating at the current rate. There will be a rebellion next turn. Bollocks, right. That's not good for me, is it? So, how am I going to deal with this? First of all, we're going to get my authority up there. Minus three there. Can't afford any more. Well, I could get Ballista from here. That'd be good. And War Dogs. The Ballista would be useful, but I can't afford it at the moment. Actually, I just remembered something. I got those mercenaries, so... Uh, let's just disband one of them. Don't want to be too weak in Tarquin. I lost my... Ten. These good units. We'll disband another one. We'll just keep one for now. I know it's going to cost us a bit of money, but yeah, we need to keep a fairly strong force there. And I haven't got enough money at the moment to recruit. I could recruit next turn. What are we missing? Oh, they haven't got very good units here, have they? But we have got some good units in Spalletium. With my army, Total War Network's Dragonheart. So we will, we will go for some... Uh, we'll wait till next turn until we start recruiting because I need to think about that. But we've taken these two now. Yeah, they're raiding. They're going to probably take Pisai. That's probably why we are suffering so badly with our with our public order. Yeah, it looks like it. I have a spy. Didn't know I had a spy. My spy can go over here. Do some spying for me. In Genoa. And I have an army now in the south. Just go down here quickly. Let's get them into Lilibium. In case Carthage decides to attack, I want to make sure we have something there to defend ourselves. So let's get this army in for now. Public order's increased. I'm going to increase 
and upgrade some of these units as well. Now that's going to be our point for going to war with Carthage, I think. Don't need to worry about Syracuse right now. The Samnites seem happy enough. I think they're our clients. Double check. Yeah, they're a client state of ours, so we need to worry about them. Either the Etruscans, we need to worry about. Got lots of buildings to upgrade as well. It's going to take a while, this is. Uh, yeah, we'll end turn. End turn, I think. Maybe we can squeeze in one more battle before the end of this episode. Oh shit, not again. Right, my ally is the Veneti. The boy I... Break alliance. I can't be asked to go to war with too many people. Uh oh. Shit. What do we have? We don't stand a chance, do we guys? Can I... Uh, yeah, a lot to resolve this. I would fight there, but we saw what happened last time they attacked us. We had shit units like that, and unfortunately it wasn't to be. There we are. They actually killed more then in the auto resolve than, than I fought it before. Rebellion in Tarquin Quinai. Tarquin, Tarquin, Tark, Tark, Tark. Right. This is the Rebellion Army. Latin Rebels. So, first of all, the technology, and I think I'll try and fight this army here. So, first things first, we want to... 15% diplomacy of the Italian factions, that might be handy, maybe not, let's see. Lex Claudia de Senatorbius. Wealth from all regions, we'll go for that for now. Four units, I'm going to fight them with this army in a second. Before that, I want to increase my army. I want to get that ballista. That's one thing I need to get definitely up here. And what else do we need? We need some. I want to get some war dogs. Don't mind seeing some war dogs with my army. And we're going to fight this battle now against the Latin rebels. Oh, they run away. You pussies. We're going to fight them. Put down this rebellion quickly. I could all resolve this as well. But I want to show you guys another battle because I just want to squeeze one more in before we wrap up this part. The Thunderbolts of Tinia. Get our um, experience go in with my with my units in this army. And who knows, hopefully we can build a couple of strong northern armies to keep the peace in the north of Italy. Foggy conditions, uh, we want something better than that. Dry will do. And I'm just going to click start straight away. And I'm just going to click, group them all, send them all forward. <laughs> don't usually do this but I think it, I'll make an exception this time gonna fast forward this a little bit as well they're probably gonna be behind this hill I would assume as we fast forward let's see right let's see nope nothing yet nothing 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 anyone here anyone here Zoom, zoom, zoom. Let's get the cavalry right up. Super fast cavalry. Nope, no one yet. Can't see anybody. Where are they? Ah, there they are. Excellent, right. Just gonna go for super fast battle. Behind the lines. Find your targets and kill them. <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna be like the fastest battles ever. Oh chip, my general's charging. Oh that's right, it's, it's only skirmishers. Inspire yourselves and run. Oh okay. kid. Right, you came too far out there. You guys can charge in there. You guys can kill all them. You guys can kill all them. You guys can hit them in the rear. General can come around here. Charge. Kill them all. This should be over soon. Oh, they come back. Shit. Fucking cavalry. Do my head in. There we go. End of them. They're still fighting. Look at them. Brave soldiers. 
brave rebels. It's quite funny looking at this quickly. Charge! Kill them all! Surely that's the end of the battle. Nope. The general is holding on for dear life. Spire. Bring my cavalry out. Surely they're not going to live this one down. Come on, kill him. Kill the general. 136 remaining. Oh shit, they come back. There you go, I'll deal with them. Bring these down the mountain as well. Let's get them in there. They can rack up some experience. Let's have a look at our experience a minute. Yeah, not too bad. Somebody's gone up a level. My Velite's gone up a level. Just them at the moment. That's okay. Send another unit of infantry in. Send the general in. Charge! Boom! There we go. Right into the back of them. Get some inspiration going. They're not going to last much longer now. You wouldn't think. Come on, Publius Scipio. Kill them all. Charge in there with his cavalry. Pull out with the general. Pull him out. Won't be long. He's, they're doing well. Look at look how uh, easily they they put up a big fight. There. I haven't seen a general unit fight like this for a long time. Just gonna keep hitting them with, with cavalry charges until they break. Charge! Boom! Inspire again. Pull out. This one can charge. Charge! This one can charge back in. <laughs> charge! This one go back out. Oh, they're gone. Are they gone? Nope. Still it. Charge! Boom! Back out. Back in. <laughs> back out. Back in. Back out. There we go, they're starting to break now. Ah, and there we go. End battle. Decisive victory. Rebellion no more. Lost 209. But I did fight most of that battle on triple speed. Battle duration 14 minutes. Didn't feel like 40 minutes, believe me. Um, so that's a victory for us there. Ooh, in the face. Kill the captives. Military traditions. And that should be... Ooh, that's the end of you. So, rebellion vanquished. And then we should have enough movement points to get back into Tarquin... Quinii. I think it's Tarquinii. And I can level up this army as well. So we shall go for... And... Yeah, I like the melee units inflicted damage, so we'll go for that. Minus 10, oh my god, we're going to have a rebellion again. In two turns time we're going to have a rebellion, that's not good at all. Okay. What else do we want to do? Recruit in there, that's good. Don't have any money left, unfortunately. Let's look at diplomacy quickly, let's see. Du -du 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 -du. At war with lots of people. Not many people like us. Could get some trade with the Samnites. That might help us for now. Nope, don't want trade. Okay. Massa Ely, what are you going to do to me? Trade? Nope. No trade for you. Okay, so Libya. I think we tried Libya and they didn't want anything. Uh, I think we'll end turn once more. Not much we can do this time around. And then I'll probably wrap up this part. This first part of Total War Network's Let's Play for Rome 2. Probably at the end of this, this end turn. Ally attacked. Oh, fuck. Master Ely and my ally. Enter the war on side of ally. There we go. Ooh, texturing problems. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh, this is not good, guys. Oh, there we go. Finally. Got there in the end. What the hell was that? Right, so. Reward. Encourage populace. 
Latium et Campania. Construction complete. All the text's gone at the top. Something's gone wrong, guys. Faction countered. Ilivacones. They're from Iberia, I think. So we shall have a quick look at them in a second. So, first things first. Ilivacones, where are you? Do, 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 do. They are neutral, that's okay. So, who did we go to war with then? We went to war with these guys over here. Masili. Masili? Masaili, that's how I pronounce them. Most probably completely butchering the English language with my pronunciations of some of these factions, but but they ca can be a bit confusing. That looks like Masili, and that looks like Masaili. I know Carthage and Libya, they're pretty easy to pronounce. And Syracuse, Rome, Etruscans, Samnites. Okay, so what do we want with this part? Right, we've staved off the public order problems at Tarquinai for now. It's us on zero, so we're okay for now. We need to Whoever does the second part will probably need to work on this because that's going to cause problems, I think. But it's contested with uh, the Etruscans because they own Eretium and Pisai. So whoever takes over next will probably need to take out these two provinces and consolidate Italy before we go to war with Carthage. Total War Network Dragon Heart. I got one unit of Ballista there. What's the best units we can recruit right now? Astarte, probably. I'd like to get some units built straight away. So we'll get two units for Astarte there. We're going to get two units for Astarte there. So the two uh, armies over here are both going to be recruited for the next person. I could upgrade these towns, but I'm going to leave that because I don't want to get slums at the moment. And then Syracuse. Syracuse is. Syracuse has got a lot of armies here. I don't know what they're preparing for. May need to keep an eye on them. And then we've got this army over here. The Harbingers of Febris. I'm going to upgrade their equipment for the next person as well. And I think I can finally end the first part of Total War Network's Let's Play for Total War Rome 2. So I hope you've all enjoyed. And I'd like to wish the person who takes over this campaign in the second part the best of luck. And hopefully they can win some great battles. So hope you all enjoyed this part. I've been Dragonheart. Until next time, goodbye.